Hey, what's up guys? Larry here. All this truth going on in 2020. What the 2020 is going on? First Corinthians. Turn your Bibles. You got a Bible? First Corinthians chapter 13. The way of love. Do you know that God is love? Do you know that we cannot have love unless God gives it to us? in this sinful flesh that we live in, this fallen state, the only way we're going to have love is if you ask God to get born again. And uh, He is love. And, and it's not that we love God, it's that He loved us. He first loved us. If He doesn't first love us, we have no love because God is love. We need to be filled with that love. But you got your Bibles? You ready? Chapter 13 of 1 Corinthians, it says, Though I speak with the tongues of men and of angels, and have not charity, I am become as sounding brass or a tinkling cymbal. And though I have the gift of prophecy, and understand all mysteries, and all knowledge, and though I have all faith, so that I could remove mountains, and have not charity, I am nothing. And though I bestow all my goods to feed the poor, and though I give my body to be burned and have not charity, it profiteth me nothing. Charity suffereth long and is kind. Charity envieth not. Charity halteth not itself, it is not puffed up, doth not behave itself unseemly, seeketh not her own, is not easily provoked. Thinketh no evil, rejoiceth not in iniquity, but rejoiceth in the truth. Very important. Beareth all things, believeth all things, hopeth all things, endureth all things. Charity never faileth. But whether there be prophecies, they shall fail. Whether there be tongues, they shall cease. Whether there be knowledge, it shall vanish away. For we know in part, and we prophesy in part, but when that which is perfect is come, then that which is in part shall be done away. When I was a child, I spake as a child, I understood as a child, I thought as a child, but when I became a man, I put away childish things. For now we see through a glass darkly, but then face to face. Now I know in part, but then shall I know even as also I am known. Ooh. And now abideth faith, hope, charity. These three. But the greatest of these is charity. Love. If, if love is the foundation of everything, God is love. I mean, Jesus, the good Samaritan, uh, he, compassion, Jesus. He loved folks, and sometimes that love caused him to make a whip and run the the jays out of the temple. They left their money and run. <laughs> Jesus got mad that day, angry, but he sinned not. But love, if whatever you're doing is not, if it's not about love, It's wrong. Love your neighbor as yourself. Love God. Love your neighbor as yourself. Pray without ceasing. Ask for forgiveness every day. None of us are perfect. We all need Jesus. You may not tell him all the time. If it wasn't for you, we'd all go to hell. We're all, every one of us like sheep have gone astray. All our righteousness is filthy rags. We are totally dependent on the Lamb, on Jesus Christ, that his work at Calvary, when he said it's finished. I, I totally, that's where I put my faith. I don't put my faith in this world. I'm not of this world. I'm here. But <laughs> love, whatever you do, it should be based in love. And, and when you think about it, you know, you're, you're not going to rob someone if, if you love them. 
You're not going to murder someone if you love them. You're not going to abort your baby if you love it. You're not. Love. Love conquers a multitude of sins, it says somewhere. Covers. Love covers a multitude of sins. It, it speaks in the Bible somewhere. Love just. And it can't be manufactured or faked. You either got love or you don't. Hey, that's all I wanted to say. I wanted to read some scripture. I'm not trying to put too much in it, but I think that's pretty important because I tell you what, love is waxing cold and evil is waxing worse. It, it's... Evil is getting rampant. It's... It's a party of faith. It's, I love you guys. Get born again. Later.